Student members of the Hallsville FFA chapter recently gave others the chance to learn about different animals through the hands-on experience of a petting zoo. Students from all buildings throughout the district, local daycare providers, and the general public were invited into the agriculture shop at the high school to see, touch, and read about a wide variety of student-owned animals. Um, we're doing a petting zoo to get the primary and intermediate schools involved and get to see animals and get to understand what they are and what they do. A lot of them don't know the names of stuff. Like with Remington, they think he's either a wild boar or a guinea pig. They just, they're surprised when they see stuff and see how big they are. And I think it's very important because some of the little kids don't ever get that experience to see them. And so the fact that they can come here and see it for the first time and also so they don't know so they know that their food doesn't come from the grocery store, it comes from an actual farm from actual animals. High school students weren't the only ones involved in bringing in their animals. Hallsville Intermediate student Allison Borland also had the chance to bring in and show off her new calf. Showing my calf. His name is Whiskers. He's around two months old. The kids really like petting him, and, but he was a little shy, so it was kind of hard. Zoo visitors saw a wide variety of mammals, birds, and even reptiles at the event, some of which they may have only seen in textbooks. Throughout the day, smiles were abundant, eyes were wide, and learning took on a whole new level. Even the egg shop eventually returned back to normal. For Hallsville Public Schools, I'm Roger Brawlier.